Welcome to Forensics Detectors. I am Dr. Cause you guessed me the gas detector, and today I am your vape, your vape e-cigarette detection expert. And today we are presenting our wall mount, our wall mount vape detector also detects weed e-cigarettes and cigarette smoke for mounting permanently on a wall, on a ceiling, in a bathroom, in a school, in a public facility, folks. We've been getting many calls for these type of products. And Dr. Cuz, the world's number one gas detection expert, has been studying and trying to understand the best way, the most reliable way, the most sensitive way to detect particles coming from vape, coming from cigarette smoke and other places. Not only for today, folks, but tomorrow, these industries are innovating and if it isn't one thing today it's going to be something else tomorrow so we have to think forward and we have to think what is the best way to detect these particulates the smoke coming from all these innovative products and the only way to do it folks is to use particulate matter detection using laser scattering detection technology which is very stable the sense will last many many years and calibration is not necessary and in addition to that the threshold the sensitivity level can be adjusted and it is up to you how sensitive you want to pick up the smoke okay folks now there is a lot to talk about today but the main thing is the following this guy is made number one as a deterrent look at the cosmetics look at the aesthetics not to be messed with by students by people working for your company okay so it has a deterrent cosmetic type of visual okay it has an explosive proof case and the sensor that detects all the particles is at the bottom over here the laser detection sensor is right there okay it's very easy when it comes to you it comes with a power supply you plug up to the wall the cable runs through this jack and it provides power if the alarm does go off you're going to be seeing an led and buzzer okay folks very very sensitive indeed it spans pm 2.5 pm 10 and pm 1 okay folks that means it takes care of all the broad diameters of these particles that are that are emitted from various products e6 weed cigarettes and many others okay folks so not only is that important for today but if new products new technologies for smoking comes along you're going to be sure that your sensor captures all the diameters that is emitted when one smokes these products okay it's very important to ask that question and to make sure your detector captures the most broad spectrum of particles that are suspended in the air very very important indeed it helps with reliability it helps in reducing your false positives okay folks now this guy has relays inside so if you want to be alarmed in the office if you want to be alarmed where the trigger point goes somewhere else there are relays so you can wire it up your electrician your maintenance person can wire it up any way you wish this does not i repeat this does not send emails it does not send notifications sms it does not do that folks so what we're trying to do is keep things as simple as possible have a deterrent and have something that alarms now if you want the other bells and whistles it's not over here folks you have to go to our competitors that offer that and there is a price to be paid for it we are not offering it and we want to keep it bare bones and simple and easy to understand for any school district at any budget to install that is our philosophy okay folks and you get an amazing product that's super reliable and will last you many years to come which is very important even if someone throws rocks at it even if someone tries to abuse it it's going to be protected but you're going to say dr cos what about the wire well you can hardwire this with some pvc plumbing your electrician can do it so it's 100 percent bulletproof okay folks um so that is your prerogative how you wish to install it and where you want it to be placed you may want to be placed out of sight in sight for deterrent purposes now this comes with a remote control for controlling the alarm thresholds and to change them it comes with your manual very easy to read color manual and your quality assurance certificate tested here in los angeles in california okay folks from our technicians and engineers now what we're going to do is do a little demo i've got someone here it's going to be puffing some vape smoke in this direction and you could see the numbers here folks there are three numbers pm 1.0 pm 2.5 
and PM10. These are just all capturing different particles at different diameters. The laser is working, it's scattering off these particles and it's detecting that from a, a photo diode that's inside, okay? But that's the way it goes, it's very simple. You will hear the LED, you will hear the buzzer, okay? So check it out, give it about 30 seconds and you'll see the numbers climbing. I'm gonna be sitting, vaping, um, from about four feet away, okay, you probably won't even see the smoke, and you're gonna see the numbers start to climb, okay? Now, I know some of you out there, oh, Dr. Kai, that's way too close, and it should be, you should undertake this experiment much further away. Look, folks, the way it works is that smoke particles accumulate, okay? It's not gonna detect it from your students in the bathroom secretly smoking and vaping in the first breath or two. It's not gonna work that way. No detector will do that, okay? it will has has to come up to some threshold has to accumulate and then the vape will go off okay so let's check it out Okay, that last puff was a fair puff and you could see the numbers starting to climb like that. Now, I have set the thresholds quite high. The thresholds can always be lowered for your sensitivity level. It depends how often you want the teachers and the administrators to be called, but it's again up to you, you have that option. We could set them as high and as low. And as I'm talking and as I'm, we're undertaking this demo, we see here we have the handheld version, okay? This is our handheld version. Perfect for spot checking, okay? Perfect for spot checking and perfect to see if someone has been smoking. This is not meant to be a fixed device like this guy over here, okay? Okay, and again, the particles are accumulating. They build up slowly. With time, the numbers go up. You could have already set the threshold to, to alarm. I'm gonna come close now, and we're gonna see it trigger. We're gonna see it go up quite a bit now. And you will see it trigger, there it is. So that is the LED and that's the buzzer, okay folks? That's how it sounds and that's how it behaves, okay? It turns off when the levels go down. Now, um, you may want to take the wire, as I said, to your administrative office to see that you may not want it to alarm in the bathroom. This can be moved to your office with a long piece of wire. So you have the versatility to set it up any way you wish. And this is a basic instrument. It's basic functionality. You don't need a special installer or anything like that. Your local e electrician, your local maintenance person can do that. It's quite straightforward. Okay, look, I hope that helps. Again, we have thought about the budgets. We have thought about the cost constraints that school districts go through and we've tried to make this as bare bones yet as super reliable, as super strong because we know those students in those bathrooms what they do, okay? We've been there. I've seen it with my own eyes when I was younger and it's not a very friendly environment, put it that way. Okay, look, till then, be well. Any questions, give us a call. Hope you're well. Be safe. See you later.